everybody and welcome to Edinburgh. Uh, Emily and I are here for a couple of days, we've already been here for one of those, but Emily was working so I just went around gallivanting, taking some b-roll and some photos. Uh, I tried to explain that yesterday, but I don't think I did a very good job. And then Emily's with me tomorrow because she's working today. She'll be with me and then we'll, I'll maybe take photos, but it's mainly today that I'm going to be taking the photos and video and stuff because tomorrow she'll... We've both been here before, but when I came here it was dark and I was drunk and Emily's only really been here for work, so we're both seeing it afresh a little bit uh, and I'm hoping that we can bring a bit more of an informative tour than I managed yesterday. That's the City Arts Centre. H&M. few learnings so far from Edinburgh. Uh, the bagpipes do not stop. I think it gets a bit much after a while if you're not Scottish. and the seagulls are crazy. But yeah, today I think will involve some looking around, food, and most definitely wine. Can you hear them now? I mean, I like it, but it's constant. here today, how did they manage to get everybody in? Because it's not very big looking, is it? We see you today, you have four floors just there. We're on a tour and it's raining. The man's wearing a kilt. And the man's wearing a kilt, but he's Irish. Is he? Yes. Do you think he was Scottish? I have no idea, we all sound the same. I can't say that. It's called Donal. Donald. Donald. And he was wearing a kilt. And I can't tell the difference between the two accents. <laughs> Sorry. Oh dear. Anyway, time for coffee. Ooh, look at that rain shower. Ugh. That's coming our way. Can you spot the Impa Lumpers? Looks like they're all having a bit of a mother's. <laughs> oh, nice. Well, plan A of getting a coffee's gone out the window because all the cafes are shut. Uh, and plan B was going to be going to a gin bar, but we decided that might be better after dinner. Uh, so plan C is going to Tesco's to get some hot chocolate sachets. So, <laughs> rock star lifestyle in Edinburgh. We're living on our little holiday. Any good? Yeah, I think so. Hmm. Oh god, what's she got? <laughs> How did that happen? I know. Okay, we're scrapping plan C. Can't be bothered with hot chocolate. Moving straight to plan D. Oh dear. Right, we've got our glad rags on. Emily looks dazzling. Do I? You look gorgeous. She's also memorised the entire menu of the restaurant we're going to, haven't you? Yeah. What are you going to have? Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to have. I know everything's on the menu. Uh, okay. Okay. I just don't know we'll, what I'm uh, going to have. We'll get back to you when we do. <laughs> Say, say cheese. Just have a selfie. Cheese. Three, two, one. I'm only joking. It's video. <laughs> <laughs> well, coffee was a lot better than how I feel. Can't think why. Yeah, we've only got a couple of hours left in Edinburgh uh, on this wonderful sunny morning. But um, no idea where we're going or what anything is. I think I've completely given up on the idea of this being an informative tour video. I don't know anything. We need Dougal. Dougal? Donald. Donald. That's that Donald dog. From, Donald from the castle. <laughs> yeah, the Scot. The Scot. Donald. <laughs> and we just met another Scot as well, didn't we, in the shop? She was Scottish. She was Scottish. 100% Irish. <laughs> Please don't take this level of information in this video <laughs> as a level for other videos. I'm hoping that I can actually impart some kind of wisdom in Yeah, the I won't be in them, so that'll help. Emily won't be in them. <laughs> right, where are we going next? Somewhere up, old? Up there, yeah. We're going to an old thing next. He's a key player of the Scottish Enlightenment. He's got something to do with writing and philosophy. There we go. I think we can pass this off as a tour now. Yeah, excellent. Great, done. The tour's really flowing now. 
So the path we're walking on at the moment is Hume Walk. Runs around the hill and joins with Regent Walk, which you know what? Was one of the first public walking routes to be created in Britain. Fair play. Well, yeah. Public walk. That looks interesting. Let's go find out what that is. The National Monument. Commemorate, and this is serious. Commemorate the Scottish soldiers who died during the Napoleonic Wars. Very good. It's very nice. Oh shit. What have you found? And then my battery ran out. We didn't miss much though, because we just went in that shop, got Emily a birthday present, came out, came home, and that was that, so, vlogging's hard.